Celebrating Super Bowl 52, coming to the Twin Cities, 1500 ESPN, in partnership with the Minnesota Super Bowl host committee present 52 super stories leading up to the big game from our own Patrick Royce. Bob McGinn, the great Packers writer from the Milwaukee newspaper, who recently retired, actually, but I'm sure he's uh, still going to be cranking out a bunch of NFL stuff, has uh, written a book uh, a couple of years ago, The Ultimate Super Bowl Book. He's got a list in there, one of his lists, top ten goats of the Super Bowl. Now, the one that surprised me was the man he had at number ten, Troy Palomulo from the Steelers in Super Bowl 45. The NFL Defensive Player of the Year for 2010 took himself out of plays all day long. He could never get a read on Aaron Rodgers and was as ordinary as ordinary can be. That surprised me more than anybody on the list. The rest of the list, more familiar probably to people. Number five, Jackie Smith, tight end and Cowboys, Super Bowl 13. Smith's drop of a three-yard pass in the end zone. Didn't lose it for the Cowboys, but it surely didn't. Happen. And they're going to throw. Oh, he's got it. Wide it open. Oh, up. Drop. Veteran Jackie Smith. And he let a sure touchdown pass get away. Jackie Smith is wide, wide open. Nobody within 10 yards of him. And almost too far open. Now, the rest of these are kind of off-the-field things. Stanley Wilson... Running back, Bengals, Super Bowl 23. News of his cocaine binge was delivered to the players at the Saturday night meeting. And number one, the shocking one, uh, Eugene Robinson, the free safety from the Falcons. Uh, night before the game, he was supposed to be the team leader. Arrested not far from the team hotel on the Saturday night before the big game. So, in addition to heroes, the Super Bowl, after all these years, has its share of goats also. 52 Super Stories continues next week with another great yarn from Patrick Royce. And for more details on Super Bowl 52 coming to the Twin Cities in 2018, sign up for the host committee email at mnsuperbowl.com.